The Hotel Rexford's got rooms for rent, if you want something more comfortable than a bedroll on the floor. I think you've stepped into the wrong place, sweetheart. You don't look like you need the memory den. Do you even know what we do here? No idea. What is this place? The name's kind of a big hint. Memories. We let our selective clients relive the past. And we don't accept just anyone. Why not? Look, it's no secret that reliving a memory can be about having a good time, or helpful in remembering something you've forgotten or lost. But like anything worth doing in life, honey, it's got a kick to it, and the first time can be traumatic. So I keep the client list very small. People I trust. It helps us avoid a lot of unpleasantness. You're cautious, I respect that. But I think I can handle it, if you'll just give me a chance. Well, I suppose there's no harm in giving you a trial run. Now, memories involving other people are easiest. Recent events involving loved ones, uh, does anything come to mind? be about something else. Well, this is a trial run. I want to see how you handle a clear memory. And in all my time doing this, nothing stands out like love and family. I lost my son recently. Kidnapping. I'd do anything to see him again. A missing child. Oh, that's awful. I'm so sorry, sweetheart. But I think we can help you. All right, sit down in the lounger. Let's see what memory we can find. Dr. Amari, we have a new problem. Can you find a memory we can plug into? What kind of memory are we looking for? Our client is a father. Look for a memory about his son. All right, scanning the hippocampus. I found something very recent. The sink with the temporal lobes is strong. That, 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 that's the one. Lift the curtain, honey, it's showtime. <laughs> 